by the 2018 NCAA Division I National Champion at 174 pounds, Zahid Valencia from Arizona State. As a reminder, uh, the press conference is being transcribed off-site, so please uh, raise your hand and wait for a microphone before asking questions. Uh, please identify yourself and your news outlet when asking your question. We'll start right here in front. Mike Tim from Wynn. Uh, Zahid, that scramble you had with him where it looked like you Easy to have an easy takedown. It did not happen. Why did you not lose any momentum or confidence in yourself? I mean, for me, I knew his defense was going to be excellent. I couldn't make any mistakes. I had to be pretty much perfect in all my shots. So, in that type of moment, you can't, you know, get fatigued or get too caught up in that moment. You have to go go out and get the next one. Question over here. Marshall Cooper, Flow Wrestling. Um, uh, a couple times during the match, they would flash your dad on the camera. I think he was in the third row right up front and screaming and yelling. But talk about just kind of growing up. I know you guys had the monster garage and then all the way till now uh, being a national champion. Talk about that process from a little kid till now. Yeah, for me, I mean, I've just been blessed with you know, great parents, great family, great teammates, coaches, you know, everything. Also, you know, God's blessed me with a lot. You know, I think I have everything in my life. And, you know, growing up, this was a goal. Me and my brother, my dad, my whole family. So I started when I was two, and now it's a dream come true. It's just been amazing. It's been a roller coaster of a journey. I'm just excited to be on top now, and I'm glad my dad was able to watch me do that. Question down here. Uh, Jason Scott of News Mesa. Uh, Coach Zeke said this week that sometimes you, you're too aggressive, that you're shooting too often, trying to extend yourself. Um, how do you kind of? I mean, for me, that's just the way I train. That's the way uh, my coaches tell me to wrestle. I mean, I over wrestle. I take a thousand shots a match. Uh, it's not for everybody. I really have to get your conditioning up. But at times, yeah, I could over wrestle, make some mistakes. You can see it in uh, my semis match. But I knew I could come back and get more takes on than that. A guy like Mark, I have to be a little bit more conservative. Conservative, not in the sense where I take less shots, just smarter shots making sure I just don't overreach or anything like that. So that's what I focused on. Question here in the center. Mike Willis, USA Wrestling. Uh, Zahid, you're the first NCAA champ at Arizona State under Zeke Jones. Can you talk about that? I mean, it's amazing. Uh, when I got recruited by him, you know, he had this dream, this goal, and he brought me along with, say, you know, starting something in the West Coast at ASU, uh, doing the whole folk style, freestyle, becoming the best in the world. And I really believed in him. And I was uh, been working with him for a few years now. I think I've gotten a lot better. Uh, I mean, I think you can see it. So it's just been amazing being able to be coached under him. Other question, in, sir. Uh, Z, uh, Jay Day with uh, USA Wrestling. You lost to Mark uh, last year in the semis. What emotions are you feeling towards being since loss and finish on top of the podium? I mean, it's hard to explain. It's an awesome feeling just being out there and seeing. All the fans just going crazy after that win. I mean, most of them were probably Ohio State fans. But uh, no, I mean, it was awesome just uh, being able to get my revenge. You know that everyone says that exhibition match didn't count. And it really doesn't. Even that undefeated season doesn't really matter. You have to go 5-0 in this tournament, like I said before. So I mean, I'm just really grateful and blessed to be here. Question over here in front. You mentioned several times how always been ahead of thought of being the national champ. Do you remember what got you to that point? What in your mind first said, I can do this? I mean, we were, me and my brother were younger. You know, my first year I didn't do too hot. Went one in 18. And then my dad said, you know what? He told my, my mom, I gotta get these guys good or else they're not gonna like it. Cause at the end of the day, you guys say uh, winning's fine. If you do a whole lot of losing, you're not gonna like the sport. So as soon as uh, we started getting really good, me and my brother, we decided, hey, let's make goals for our, for each other. So I mean, we just we're shooting for the stars, you know, world champ, Olympic champ, for uh, time as a double A champ. But that's all you can do is really reach for them. So you need to have two more questions. One of which it hasn't been that long ago that you were like a, a 132 pounder in high school, being a three time state champ, and. You talk about how you've grown so fast for a lot of people. A lot of people think you may go 184. And also, then talk a little more about your relationship with your brother. Like you said, you guys have been like that. Yeah, I mean, my my weight's been all over the place. I mean, I see guys here wrestling at 125 even. I'm like, oh, I remember wrestling that dude. But I mean, I used to cut a lot of weight in high school. 
but now I think the better I've gone, and I feel better just you know going more of my natural weight. I think it's been better for me, and I mean I, I can't tell you what I'm gonna go next year. It's just the way the summer goes with everything, you know, trials. And with me and my brother, it's been an incredible journey. Uh, starting, I was two, he was three, doing everything together. And I'm, uh, I'm upset that you know he can't have this feeling right now, but he's got two years left, and I believe in him. And you know, both of us are gonna keep working to when it be those two brothers standing right here next to each other, national champs. Good time for one more question. Nope. All right. Congratulations, Eve. Thanks for your time. Thank you.